The martial arts can teach you to be healthy, but the philosophy and the practice behind Taoism can teach you how to be like a better person, can teach you how to be more relaxed emotionally. But I think with Taoism, it's, it's, a, it's a path that lasts forever. You know, it's, it's always, it's, it's nature, so you can observe it, you can, you know, Dao Fa Zeran. You can follow nature very quickly. And we find these principles, and that's a much easier way to improve our life. Big circles, timing your breath at the moment. I feel more relaxed, I'm more stress-free, I'm able to handle a difficult situation better. You know, in Taoism we have the phrase chiku, like eating bitter. And we all know that good medicine is bitter. So it's a challenge, but it's something that we can accept. So I think this is a big principle in Taiji, you know, being able to uh, redirect uh, pressure, being able to redirect conflict. We talk about like blocking a punch, but we also block, you know, bad emotion too. So this kind of idea is very prevalent. There's a lot of unresolved conflict that continues to the next generation. And I think it's really important for us to understand that uh, Chinese culture and Western culture is the world's culture. 